Singh Wan Lee, and I'm going to talk about wrong guy today. Oh, before I start, my question will be, oh, have you ever had an eating disorder, or like, how about gaining more weight than before, after you lost weight? If you say yes to either of these, then you have gone through the wrong diet system. It's called yo-yo effect, and there are many ways to lose weight, but going through the yo-yo effect will, is not the right choice. And with this, by going through the yo-yo effect, it will cause eating disorders, you will lose nutrition, and gain more weight than before. A little story about myself would be that during my high school year in my freshman, I used to be overweight, 180 pounds. And then when I was 180 pounds, uh, I wanted to really lose weight, so I started doing yo yo effect, which is like I didn't eat anything for a day or like for a week, and it just worked out. And during my 10th year, 10th grade year, I lost about 10 pounds, and then it all came back to me in 11th grade where I gained more pounds than before. One of the eating disorder would be anorexia. Uh, it, it, it is called reduced macronutrients. Um, you will not intake any food. Like you don't want to take any food because you think that even if, a, if even if it's a little amount, you will get fat. Uh, according to Gerard Lovera in her article "Choice of Diet in Patients with Anorexia Nervosa," uh, she states inpatients and controls found that reduced macronutrients and calorie intake among patients, although there was no difference when comparing calorie intake among patients. Um, usually when people want to lose weight, they have a great urge and a great will to do it. And due to the great will, they would usually go through anorexic behaviors. Um, they would also be too much focused on losing weight that they do not care about their nutrition in their body, which is food definitely. Um, another disorder would be bulimia. It is, uh, according to Kerba, Rebecca in their article states, uh, bulimia nervosa can be described as binge eating and inappropriate compensatory methods to, um, to pursue your weight gain, a weight loss. It's pretty much overworking your body because once you want to lose weight, you Start, you stop eating, and then for a few days later, you would feel the urge to really, big urge to eat, which will cause you to binge it. Um, if you do that, then it'll be work, overworking your body because you never got the nutrients throughout the days, and then you suddenly gain more, more fats and more weight. Um, as stated by these two scholarly people who wrote the articles, this bad ways to lose weight is pretty much not a common sense to do it. And for the nutrition part, common sense about diet and nutrition is that if you don't eat, you don't get nutrition. That's the fact. And unless you take vitamin pills, which is not recommended, unless you take food with it. Uh, people go on diets without thinking about their nutrition. They care more about losing weight, and they just <coughs> do not take, didn't take any nutrition. Sorry. <laughs> Um, according to Frost, in his article, Journal of Health, he suggests that taking 600 calorie, less than 2,000 calorie of your daily uh, serving would help lose weight daily and that it would be a long, t long term to lose weight. Um, however, people tend to just not eat at all, which is not nutritious at all, and they would not enough have energy to help them throughout the day. Um, also, if you don't have enough nutrition, you will, your body will withdraw, causing your immune system to lower, or um, it'll lose weight, but it'll get your immune system lower. Um, the last part would be the yo-yo effect. Um, according to Matt Fulton in his article, Health Capsule, he states um, around 75% to 90% people who lose weight with wrong diet gains the weight back. Um, this is called hypocaloric diet, which means hypocaloric means you're taking less calorie than what you should be taking. Um, this effects, um, this will definitely gain the weight back more and more. It's just happened to me. It's like your effect. It's 
like yo-yo, you throw it out and it comes back at you. Uh, my conclusion would be that there are many ways to lose weight, but it is not the way to lose weight by going through eating disorders, loss in nutrition, and going through the yo-yo effect.